Hi guys, welcome back on my channel, VST here, Venus Space Tech. Finally, this day has arrived and I do know that I say this quite a lot, this time it's for real guys. We have finally received the first Oxygen OS Open Beta for the OnePlus 8 and the OnePlus 8 Pro, right? So finally it's here, we have now Open Beta 1. A very big disclaimer guys a lot of my audience is based in India so right now the open beta one does not have Indian oxygen OS version right so people from my channel from India are watching right some function might be missing the oxygen OS 11 version for India area is expected to be released in the upcoming OBT version stay tuned okay so right now the open beta one I don't recommend this to be flush if you have an Indian device right but okay it's gonna come it's gonna come very soon all right so i'm gonna go to change lock and then we're going to download it using the oxygen os updater guys and i'm going to show you guys how to update from the very latest stable global oneplus 8 pro rom to the very first open beta one which we know already is based on android 11 right oneplus has released so far the developer preview where a lot of people already had install this on their devices and i would say that the feedback in the community was kind of mixed back and that's why i was saying that i will wait for the first open beta and then install it all right there are plenty of things i want to test like for example right now you see i have already the volti right and i do use my guides to go there using the om lock kit and enabling the switches I have been told that finally now for my country, Bulgaria, Volta should be already included like a profile for my operator. But okay guys, let's first go through the change log and then I'm gonna show you guys how to download it using Oxygen OS Updater and then I'm gonna do a full installation and a first look. So right now we have the change log. First we have system here, fresh new user interface, visual design that brings you more comfortable experience with various optimization of details brand new weather ui supports dynamic switches between sunrise and sunset you can have day and night at your hand now i mean it sounds promising right optimize the brightness bar display in status bar enabling you to quickly adjust it by pulling down quick settings there is also a new game space newly added gaming tools box for convenient switches on fanatic mode the wechat the qq and the screen recorded one place newly added miss touch prevention feature enable it swipe down from the top of the screen click and the notification bar will pop out that sounds really amazing and i think a welcome addition ambient display i mean ambient display guys added finally always on ambient display function custom schedule like all the option included you can find this we're gonna find this together in the settings display 10 new clock styles newly added inside clock styles that sounds really great and dark mode added a shortcut key for the dark mode pull down quick settings to enable so apparently you can enable right now the dark mode directly from the settings also supporting finally automatically turn on feature and customize time range and i think this is really also a very very nice addition okay then you have the zen mode okay added five new teams okay zen mode is on my thing finally also some updates to gallery supporting story function automatically form weekly videos with photos and video in storage so really plenty of updates guys but then again i'm just leaving here a warning don't try this on your oneplus 8 or oneplus 8 pro if you have the indian version it will come soon enough they say right now that it will come with the next release of the open beta all right guys now i'm going to show you how you can use os oxygen updater and download it so i have oxygen updater right one of the best apps to keep your oneplus phone updated all right so right here you can already see i have the os oxygen open beta one okay now you can go to settings guys and if you want to receive also the better updates you click on the device you have to select your device if it's not there right probably will be there and on the update method you should click here open better full update all right there is also the incremental update and there are also android 11 r developer preview right now i'm just going to keep it like this open better full update i'm going to go back guys and you're going to see that there is here a download button right so my download will start soon it is two gigabytes almost three gigabytes guys so 20 minutes guys i'm gonna leave the phone here right and when the download is finished guys i'm gonna show you how you can manually navigate 
install it and then we have to see together if the phone will boot or not. I really crossed my fingers because I have 60 gigabytes of photos and I didn't do a backup, but okay, we are living on the edge. And I do really believe in OnePlus and in the Oxygen OS team, they will not really let me down. Okay, so once we have the software, right, about 60 minutes, make sure you watch the full video, guys. You don't want to skip a step in this operation. All right. Now we have already downloaded the update and now I'm going to show you guys how you can use the file, just download it and really go to the next level. All right, so we're just going to have to go to the settings and I just want to show you guys, I am using right now the Oxygen OS 10.5.12. All right, so we have to go here to system, all right, and then to system updates. Once you click on system updates, Right, you should click here the cogwheel and then you need to choose local upgrade. And right now, guys, there is only one option the file that we just downloaded. Okay, local upgrade the system update will not affect your data. However, make sure you have a backup. I really encourage you to take a backup. I didn't do it, but I'm just a believer. So hit install no. And yeah, we just need to wait, guys. Once this is 100%, the phone is going to get rebooted. And I'm just gonna hope that I'm not going to end up with losing my photos, you know, my vacation, everything is here. Again, I really have faith in the OS Oxygen team, guys. While this thing is updating, I just wanna show you something else, guys. This is the official announcement on the OnePlus forum, again, from Gary C, who is Oxygen OS product lead. And um, why today it is very important? Because as you know, today Google released Android 11. And some of you may even have already gotten a preview of our newest version of Oxygen OS with the latest developer preview version. Again, there was a DP3, DP4. Now we're excited to bring you an even better experience with the full open beta of OS Oxygen 11 or Oxygen OS 11. And this is why I really wanted to have the open beta. Thanks to our close collaboration with Google OnePlus is one of the first smartphone brands to be able to officially bring Android 11 to you. On the day it is officially launched with the first open beta of Oxygen OS 11. By the way, today I think also the Mi 10 from Xiaomi and the Mi 10 Pro got Android 11, so really kudos and respect OnePlus and Xiaomi for doing this on the very same day Google released that one. For those of you who want to fully understand what the new Oxygen OS 11 is all about, check it out today and see it for yourself. Now faster and smoother with new design elements that add a bit of a boldness to stock Android, we think the update layout makes one hand operation easier and more intuitive and just gives you a better and more beautiful overall experience. And this is be what I'm going to look for, you know, when I just install it and have really the final product, although better, in my hands. Let's check how we are. Okay, still at 31%. I'm just going to keep the phone here, guys, and let's meet again while the phone is installing this. Cross your fingers and just hope that everything is gonna go smooth. All right, see you here. Don't skip the video again. Very simple steps, but important. So you need to follow all the steps to make sure that you do it in a very nice and seamless way. All right, don't skip the video. I'm gonna fast forward it to the time where my phone is very rebooted, hopefully with the first ever Oxygen OS Open Beta 1 for the OnePlus 8 series. Okay guys, 100% is all progress, reboot, I'm hitting it, cross your fingers for myself, hope that everything's gonna get fine. Now again, every time you're doing updates like this, you need to allow some time for the phone and the new operating system to kind of expand. So just leave it like this, don't touch it and just wait for the phone to properly reboot. All right, and now it's time to see and have a first glimpse of what the new Oxygen OS 11 is to be. By the way, by the way, we already have Volti, very nice and important indication because again, I told you guys, I've been doing some tricks to get a Volti and right now it seems that at least for my operator, the profile has been included. So this is already starting quite nice and great news. Oh, okay, wow. The menu a little bit different. By the way, it doesn't look, you know, really very distant and not familiar, so. Just gonna see here, guys. All right, definitely it's the new version. Okay, we have here the settings menu with the big indent here. And if we go to the phone, guys, we can see that we have already the 
OnePlus 8 Pro Open Beta 1. Of course, we are running the Android 11. And what can I say, guys? It's really impressive. And by the way, it's, it's very quick. Wow, all right. I have to tell you, you know, from what I see. Okay, but this is not gonna be the review of the Open Beta 1 or on the Oxygen OS 11. I'm just gonna do a full review. I need to use it for some days, of course, so that I can really get my feedback, guys. This video just has been on updating from the very latest stable global Oxygen OS 10 to the 11 one and as we see really flawless so no really big things and by the way it does work really quite well from what I see but okay open beta is always nice a very very thumbs up for OnePlus for allowing finally to have the Volte profile and I encourage you guys by the way check this if you have been using Volte on your phones before with all the nice videos that I did probably not longer needed okay guys don't forget to check my channel in a few days where I'm gonna be doing like a full review of the Octane OS 11 now based on the first open beta and then of course on the developer preview. I really hope that you have enjoyed this video and I really hope that you like my videos and if that's the case, guys, you know what to do. Subscribe to my channel and like the videos, you know, leave some comments, hit me up in Telegram or Twitter. With that said, VST over and bye.